society. I'm super excited today. Today is Friday and every week on Friday and Saturday nights uh, at five o'clock we get together and we meet and we make tons of sandwiches, gift bags. Uh, we just put goodie packages together for the people on the streets. A crew of us get together and we pray together and then we go out and we lay hands on people and it's the coolest thing ever because they're getting healed, like radical, radical healing. Uh, I would have to say my favorite healing would be I was out there praying for a girl on Hastings and she had a flesh eating disease and she was in a lot of pain and I remember just putting my hand on her back on her sweater and I just said, Lord, I just said in the name of Jesus, I said, be healed. And I felt my hand go in and it was like, and I looked at her and I was like, like you, you just got healed. And she's like, she's like, yeah, well the pain's gone. And then she put her hand on her back and she goes, oh, she goes, and the metal bar in my back went back in. I guess she had broken her back and had a metal bar put in to, to fix whatever was going on there. And because of the fleshing disease, it had come off. But after we prayed, God put it back into place. I just, these kind of things are just so cool. So I'm so excited. And another girl, she bit her tongue off. So in a, in a seizure and she was on Hastings as well. And when she put her tongue out, it was like all blue and like, and half of it was like bitten off. And like, I, I've never seen anything quite like it. And by faith, I just put my hand on her and I, I, I can be honest with you, I think I had the faith maybe for the pain to go, but not for a miracle. And when after we prayed for her, she goes and she realized like all the pain was gone. And then all of a sudden, a few minutes later, she sticks her tongue out and guys, okay, it looked like a brand new tongue. It was, I think I was freaking out more than she was. But anyways, God is on the move and God is so good. And if you want to be a come and be a part of these miracle stories, you can just get back to me. You can just send me a message. Uh, we are looking for um, people that are just like spirit filled and on fire for God. It's, uh, it's quite a unique group and it's a lot of fun. But as we go out and we lay hands on the sick, they are healed. We are equipping, we are training people. People are going out and never have healed a person before and now we're training them. They're laying hands on people and they're also being healed. Like it is, it is such a movement. The testimonies are just gonna keep pouring in. Uh, we have videotaped quite a few of the testimonies so we'll be able to put them on uh, this YouTube channel. We're just super excited. Uh, so again, this is Chelsea, the CEO from Pink Sapphire Society. We're excited to keep you posted on what's happening as the revival hits the streets of Vancouver. And we hope to talk to you soon.